and climate change are very important subjects of today's world and I personally think that it is our personal duty, each one of us present over here, to contribute towards this in our little way that we can. And as Dr. Asma has recently said, that the simplest thing we can do is to plant a tree anywhere where we can. If we don't have place in our houses, we can plant it alongside the road. We can just throw the seeds of fruits that we eat, we collect them, and as we pass by in our vehicles, we can just throw them in the open areas that are present, where soil is present, so that we are able to plant trees on the way. This is the simplest way we can contribute towards the society as our contribution towards climate change. It is a very important aspect and for generations to come and for our next generations, it is important for us to look into this aspect, to look after the future generations, we all need to contribute. And with this note, I thank you all for your time. Organized by Department of Botany, University of Karachi. Me, as a collaborator, representing Office of Research, Innovation and Commercialization, which is shortly called Auric University of Karachi. Initially, Auric was a baby plant, which had been nurtured by former director Auric, Professor Dr. Alia Rahman, under the kind support of Vice Chancellor, University of Karachi. And now, me and my team has got a responsibility to take care of all the, you know, uh, centralized hub of this University of Karachi. Oryx's main objectives are research support, commercialization, event management, and capacity building, and especially entrepreneurship. I'm glad that Department of Botany, University of Karachi, shows his presence in every aspect and contribute his excellence in research and innovation. I would like to congratulate organizing committee of this seminar to highlight the importance of connecting link between plants and environment and to aware the audience to save mother nature. The only way to save the environment from enormous destruction is to plant countless trees and increase the green rate. Let's make a promise to at least plant one tree in our vicinity because even a small change can bring a change. I'm looking forward to hearing thoughts of guest speakers on all the important issues of environmental protection. Thank you for your attention. I wish you a very successful event. Thank you very much. Ex-Director General, National Institute of Oceanography, uh, distinguished guests, dear colleagues, and participants, assalamu alaikum. It gives me immense pleasure to be here with you in this morning at the opening ceremony of one day seminar on the plant and environment protection. On the behalf of the Department of Botany, I would like to extend a very warm welcome to all participants in this seminar. Also like to extend a special thanks to our sponsor partners, which includes OIL, EFU and ESA laboratory. From the few past decades, we have been seeing an unprecedented prominence of climate change that has been drastically damaging our ecosystems. Therefore, the importance of green bird of autotrophs cannot be ignored towards the global problem of rising temperature. Due to this problem, we are facing rising level of sea and constant destruction of ozone layer. Hence, the theme of this one day seminar, Plants and Environmental Protection, is the core principle that bind us all to protect this ecosystem for our upcoming generation that could survive in this world with better environment. Challenge before us is to fight with this climate change by protecting our ecosystem and increase the canopy of global forest so we can minimize the global warming. Furthermore, plants are the only wrestler that can mitigate climate change 
other and other environmental issues. It is the time to protect plants and to convert past barren land into today's fertile land. Thanks. The destruction of climate change in Pakistan is uh, among the top 10 countries to be most affected by this uh, ego terrorist called global warming. We have choose to achieve rapid and large social reduction of emission to keep the global of uh, limiting global warming to 1.5 degrees centigrade. Or we accept that humanity faces a bleak future on this planet. The main purpose of this uh, session is to deliver the valuable ideas and information among students regarding the unhealthy practices which cause destruction of the environment happening around the world, which will be major objective of this uh, seminar and this meeting. Climate change occurs a long-term weather pattern or change, burning of fossil fuels, coal, oil and gases, and cutting trees in huge mass, resulting 42% carbon dioxide emission in the atmosphere. Several common reasons are noticeable, like deforestation, rising maximum and minimum temperature, Drought, less drought rate, reducing agriculture yield, misuse of uh, agrochemicals, uncertain precipitation, melting of glaciers, flooding and soil erosion, results, raising temperature day by day, summer season become more longer and winter are shorter which is reduce the crop growing season, force maturity and reduce yield. This trend can be observed our major crop such as wheat, peas, maize, potatoes, potatoes and other crops. Now we need to ensure food security to increase the productivity and gross income per capita in our farming societies and communities. So I once again thank you for me for listening to from me. Thank you very much. The participation. This event would not be possible without the support of our sponsors. So we are highly thankful to Dr. Farhan Isa, Managing Director, Isa Laboratories, Mr. Mohammad Hezan Sadiqi, Zonal Manager, EFU Life Insurance Company, and Aurik University of Karachi from their financial support. I also acknowledge the Chairperson, Department of Botany, for her supporting behavior and continuous encouragement to proceed for this event. At the end, I highly appreciate the effort of the organizing committee to make this event successful. Dear audience, with this inaugural section, I invite all of you, all of you to have a cup of tea with us outside the auditorium. We will meet here again to listen to our guest speakers after half an hour. Thank you.